<laughs> Guys, I shouldn't be streaming right now. I have work to do. But I can't stop thinking about this deck. What is the essence of life point gain mill? Runix definitely helped with the mill part, but like, what else is there to it? How do I mill with this? <sighs> this is work? It's not work. Runic life point mills like Tyrant Neptune with life point gain kill decks. <laughs> it's the mana logs, the logs, logs. Yeah, it's the mana logs. Hello there. Genshin won award in them. The game awards are rigged. Who cares? Are you guys ready for some... Let's see, your opponent draws one card. Then you banish the top four cards of your opponent's deck. <gasps> this seems like something I should run three copies of. It is not destroyed. Uh, banish opponent of the number of cards they control. Ooh, that sounds like it's probably good. Let's see, dried wins. The only ways I have to gain life points is like Cauldron of the Old Man and like dried wins and Golden Ladybug. How do I gain life points during my opponent's turn more easily? <gasps> oh! <laughs> Once per turn, during the end phase, gain a thousand life points. Runic Wings. Oh my god. Runic Wings, I fucking love you. I forgot you're a life point gainer! Alright, let's go. I didn't mean to say the F word. I F'd it up. The spell absorption? No. Add time this minute? Wait, did someone redeem add time? There's already an add in progress. I have to wait a little bit. Runic life point gain? Yeah. Are you guys ready for some runic life point gain mill? Because I am. I just have to save this one first. Um, let's see, Labyrinth Zark. Let me look at this real quick. Did I make any changes to it? It looks like it's the same as the one I'm using over here. Are there any obvious? Yeah, no, yeah, this is a little bit different. Looks like I have three Lord of the Heavenly Prisons in this version. Yeah, I think that's the biggest difference. Oh, oh yeah, because this one's running Dogmatic of Punishment. Let me just delete this one. I had to remove Dogmatic of Punishment because it screws up the deck. Copy deck. Oh, I've been ignoring all the messages and stuff. Give me a second. I'm just so excited. Lab Ruins the Arc. Okay, let's save that. Edit the deck and oops, change accessories. Protector, this one, dual field, field parts, field base, three main cards. Okay, I got it. All right. Um, thanks for the sub space business. And the resub corner sheep. How has ten months passed already? <gasps> I'm almost at the one year. I'm almost at the one year anniversary. I started streaming in December twenty second. Dude, what should I do for my twenty? I professionally dodge all twenty. Shut the fuck up. I I I uh, much more call it. I need to do something for uh for twenty for the one year anniversary of streaming on Twitch. What should I do? Thanks for the resub, Amicron. Let's go, four months, hell yeah. And the bits, kid32888. Eight, eight, eight. Curse? <gasps> a face reveal? I need some ideas. I'll make a Twitter thread right now. Finally made your VTuber? No. I'll post it on Twitter. One year uh, streaming on Twitch and uh, Anniversary is coming up soon. What? Some good ideas that I can do for it. It's 
It's on the 22nd, I believe. One year on Twitch anniversary is coming up soon. What are some good ideas I can do for it? Okay, and I'll give you guys a link to the tweet. There you go. Oh, thanks for the gifted sub, Dax Chewy, to Lily Koizumi. Wait, Lily wasn't a sub already? <gasps> Fake fan. Here I thought me and Lily were were um were were bro brothers in arms. A Yugi Tuber collab? <laughs> I can't. I'm scared of all the, the Yugi Tubers. What if they think I'm lame? Official VTuber debut sounds good. I'm not a VTuber though. Okay, I'm gonna take runic life point gain mill into the cup. I'm gonna ruin some people's nights. You're lame? No! Hey, you subscribed to me, so maybe you're also lame. But Akizo? Bah! <gasps> First to go. Hey guys. Oh, right. I forgot that was there. You're not cool? I am cool and mysterious. How's Labyrinth and Runic? Labyrinth's a lot of fun. Dual lines, I think your image is already ruined from those stories you share. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm hashtag relatable. Hey guys, I'm Aqua Head. Um, special summon one card from your extra deck. We need this card. <gasps> oh, she has an animation. This allows me to search out the field spell card. Select one card in your hand to discard. Ooh, I'll have to ditch Lost Winds. Okay, Runic Fountain. All right. Fountain and pass. I wanted to build Labyrinth, but Runic's got me hamboned. They're both good though. Well, I mean, actually, to be honest, Labyrinth is a lot better. Ow, my nose is itchy. Seriously, Pot of Duality? Ugh. That's annoying. Runic is OP in Master Duel? Yeah, in best of one format? Oh, <gasps> They're playing Runic! I mean, Labyrinth. I don't know why I said Runic. Opponent has no Erm and Pash. How's everyone I face has negated Hyung? Uh, when this card special summon from extra decks, discard one card, add a Runic card from your deck to your hand. Oh, I guess it can be. Short stream, the pack just came out, damn it. I streamed for two hours earlier today. I shouldn't be streaming right now, but I'm obsessed. Ooh, Labyrinth Field. If you activate set Welcome Labyrinth, you can add this additional card. Blah, blah, blah. What's the gimmick of Runic? To mill your opponent. <gasps> Whoa, look at all those cards I put in the grave. We're gonna activate Runic Destruction. Target one spell trap your opponent controls. Let's destroy the field spell. Since I don't know if they have Welcome Labyrinth. They probably do, I just don't know where. Wait, what? <laughs> they quit because I destroyed their field spell? Oh my god. Ooh, level up. Return to home. Runicless, maidenless. Milling your opponent's deck while disrupting their plays. Mm -hmm. I freaking hate runics. I just can't with runics anymore. What's wrong with runics? I'm not even playing floodgates. This version of the deck is totally fine. Remember a long time ago I made a life point mill deck? I always make the life point game mill deck. I never stopped making the life point game mill deck. All I ever do is make the life point game mill deck. Look at this, a runic allure. Weekend plans? Oh yeah, it's almost the weekend. Oh, oh, oh. Ghost mode? Okay, here you go. Uh, special summon a runic card from the deck. All I do is mill, 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 no matter what. I love milling with runics. It's my favorite thing to do in the world. I wish I could mill two times. Storm. All right, we'll get this girl out. 
She looks like Enna. That's what Rosamie said on her stream. I was like, yeah, I totally get that vibe too. Um, this one's probably more useful. Ash Blossom. Oh no. <gasps> oh no, I'm ham boned. I can't believe the Yu Gi Oh guy is playing Yu Gi Oh. Of course I'm playing Yu Gi Oh. I can't believe. I can't believe I just got ham boned right there. You guys want to see the tongue? <laughs> I just finished 10 day work week. Happy the weekend is here. Excellent. Me too. They had effect Veiler too? Wow, they super could have stopped my runic. <gasps> Ooh, and Ignisters. I thought you were playing Pokemon. I was playing Pokemon. We'll activate Ghost Sister and Spooky Dogwood here. So we can gain a whole bunch of life points if they go into the Link 1. You think they also drew into called by? Because there's no way they were that lucky to draw into called by Maxi, Effect Veiler, and Ash Blossom. Wait, what? What are you guys talking about? Going Christmas shopping makes me feel alive. I get trampled at Walmart at the parking lot. Hell yeah. I tried to make Runic work with Spriggans to make them decent, but it was no bueno. Well, you can't play Runics with Spriggans because they both need the field spell. Without the field spell, Runics suck. You need the field spell. And without the field spell, Spriggans suck. You need the field spell. So they don't work together. I don't know now, but I see a ghost in your stream. <gasps> it's me, I'm a ghost. I'm here to suck your butt, blood. How come it's not working? Oh, he went for it. What an absolute buffoon. I'm gonna negate that. Target one effect your opponent controls and negate it. Yes. Suck our butt. No, I didn't say that. Lucky, that's the casual duelist cup experience. Come on, banish the top card of your deck. Ooh, look at all those cards being banished. Yes, you did. Nuh uh. It's like that one YouTuber said Master Duel players always have the out to everything. Wait, is that a reference to something? I've never heard that before. Duel Log's not playing Labyrinth. I was playing Labyrinth earlier today. You missed it. Go watch the Vaughn. Ooh, they're gonna give me so many life points. I'm gonna gain so many life points with my life point gain mill deck. I got baited by the Twitch notification. Oh, I forgot to change the notification. It's still the Labyrinth one. When you being a ghost, are you still on the moon? I am on the moon. It depends what you mean on mimics. What? I'm watching V-Rains right now. This duel is spoiling all of it. The one where they played Runix and Life Point gained Mill. Oh, they're gonna go for their combo. They're just gonna ignore all those life points I'm gaining right now. Mimics like flip effect monsters. I think I should probably play Terraform and or short stream on the day of the new release. Ooh, they're gonna go for it. No, I did a stream earlier today. He can OTK you? No, he yeah, he can't. I have too many life points. Return this card to the extra deck. 
And then he's going to destroy Runic Allure. I can't believe how my deck is hand so easily by freaking hand traps. Oh my god, is that Yuri Riri? I was just watching your stream earlier today. Ha, idiot, I have 10,000 life points, you absolute incorrigible moron. Shifter? Oh my god, that's terrible. Why couldn't I have drawn into this a turn earlier? You gotta be fucking kidding me. You're streaming so early, I feel? I can't ever raid you, so? Yeah, I am streaming early today. I, um, I got rid of my stream schedule because I was being impulsive. Or what is it? I think neurotic sounds better. Mr. Logs ham boned? I think I am ham boned. Uh -oh. I have shifter, but I can't do it. I can't. I live and die by my schedule. Good for you. Yeah, I love schedules too, to an extent, but I just, it felt like so limiting. And it's so freeing to be able to stream whatever I want instead. Wait until your enemy pulls out Exodia or an alt win con. What are they going to do? Are they going to combo for days and then be able to blast through my 10,000 life points? I have too many life points. Oh wait, if they get the field spell, I'm hand boned. Might as well just quit. And try again. I imagine it is freeing. It is freeing. I love not being told what bypassed me what to do. Um. Oh, wrong one. There's the field spell. Let's add in a third copy of that. Let's add in a terraforming and a metaverse. Hmm. Meta, meta. Where's metaverse? I think I should probably just remove Trickstar Light Stage. I don't really need Trickstar Reincarnation. No Kaiser Coliseum? Oh my god, that's a good idea. No chicken game? I don't need it. Mm. Kaiser. Okay. Mm. Sad they're missing their true field spell. I know, right? Do Cyber Valley attribute your free fusion and get a draw too? <laughs> Not a bad idea. Planet Pathfinder, maybe? No, like every single runic card searches the field spell. It's just I have to go minus one to do it. And I only get one try. What are you playing? Runic life point gain mill. Thoughts on running Dark Villain no more and Runic? I don't need it. But yeah, it's a good idea. If you wanted to play a going second version of the deck. Planet Pathfinder isn't a minus one. <gasps> it doesn't use my normal summon. You're Because I don't need my normal summon. You're right. Whoa! Runic has no trouble getting their field spell? Yeah. I was thinking, I don't need my normal summon, so I can like look at my video on best normal summons video. It's a draw phase? <laughs> Let's shotgun dimension shifter. I think I'm going first, right? No, my opponent's going first. Flew under Reese? This is completely worthless versus Flu under Rees. Oh, they're activating their field spell. They're gonna go into all their stuff. Wait, which ones do I have? Target one spell to our opponent controls, destroy it, then banish top four cards of your opponent's deck. They're playing a more than 40 card deck. That's fine. Runic Destruction's not that bad. Aren't Flu's like flexible with banishes? Uh, basically the two hand traps I have are actually just worthless versus my opponent. Exactly, this Dimension is worthless against this guy. Uh-huh. Yeah, exactly the deck that Dimension Shifter is worthless against. 
Mr. Locks, I have the flu and can't go to work until Wednesday, so please stream more so I can enjoy you. I'm in half delivery estate. <gasps> okay, I'll stream every day for three hours. No. Six hours. I don't think you're outlasting them. I'll be fine. You just have to believe... You can only activate one runic destruction per turn. You just have to believe in uh, magic. Wait, is Shifter really good in this deck? You banish your quick play spells. I'm playing a, a control deck. I can afford to skip a turn. Okay, I'm watching a Labyrinth stream. Is that the art card insane? It looks kind of insane. I've never seen it. Yeah, it's really good. Can't that makes no sense. What is Evil Eye? I could play play I could probably play Zark in this deck too. Like, I didn't even think of that until right now. Ooh. Runic Sky Striker is a good combo. Runic Sky Striker. Probably. Oh, everyone had their flu shot. <laughs> is Labyrinth of Runic better? Is Labyrinth or Runic better? Labyrinth's better. Ow, my nose is itchy. Ugh. Finally, it's my turn, and I can't do shit because my opponent ham-boned me. Let's activate Runic Fountain. do 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 I can just wait until my opponent's turn to start doing stuff. <laughs> Splitting's my opponent. Flew under Rees. Uh, field spell from your deck to your hand. I can't believe Maxi and D Fissure are useless right now. This is some bullshit. I've never been more upset before in my whole life. Reveal one in your hand, banish one Flunder Reese card with a different name from your deck, then immediately at effects resolves, normal summon, and the revealed monster. Ooh, the field spell. Let's pop that. Destroy one card your opponent controls. He said a swear? No, I didn't. You said a swear. Uh, special summon a runic monster. Hello, Mr. Logs. Hello there, Mr. Logs. Maxi. The Gaslight Logs? Shut up. You're the Gaslight Logs. Runic Storm. What does this one do? Add a Runic Continuous Spell from your deck to your hand. When a card evicted, targets a Runic card, set card. You can banish this card and negate the effect. And if you do... Um... Target one, cannot be sure by card effects. This card is special summon from the extra deck. Target one non-quick plays in your graveyard, add it to your hand. We'll go with this one. They get their one card. Activate Runic Fountain. Oh fuck, I should have used this card first. Hopefully they're not also playing Effect Veiler. Runic Allure. Fountain. Oh, Kaiser Coliseum would have been good to have. Oh, I should have ditched Max C. That was stupid of me. How many gems do you have to spend? Uh, I think I spent 20,000. Inflation be hitting different. Three ads? But you got three ads? Oh, that reminds me, somebody redeemed, um, ad time. Yeah, here you go. Three whole ads? Uh-huh. Yeah, Twitch loves their ads. What are you doing? Banishing my runics in the grave? 
I still can't believe my defi my defissure is completely useless. I need to remember to wait. What's up, dual logs? Hello there, Prague Cross 98. My free to play ass prime in the corner. What? You don't have 20,000 gems to just spend on stuff? I do. Oh, I just realized I didn't draw into any runics. I can't stop Ariza from blowing up my field right now. Greetings, Logs and Co. Greetings, J. Hartro Claire. <gasps> Elden Ring just won Game of the Year. Holy moly. Good evening, Mr. Logs. Quick question. Are you going to cosplay as the Jolly Logs or the Grinch Logs this holiday season? I didn't even think about it for two seconds. They don't have Rise of the Storm Monarch, right? Add a level 7 or higher beast monster from your deck to your hand. <sighs> Let me just try again. No, actually, I, it's, this isn't unwinnable. It's just like... I'll, I'll stick it out for a little bit. Wait, does this card protect my stuff? Uh, when your opponent activates a card or effect that targets runic cards you control or set cards you control, banish this card you control and negate the effect and if you do destroy the card. Oh, it does protect me from Ryza. They can just attack over it before they go into Ryza, though. Another MPEM, huh? I don't even summon my cards in attack position, you absolute buffoon. You incorrigible moron. Ryza these nuts. Excellent. Good job. Hi, Dual Logs. Hello there, Louise Loser. What is he doing? I haven't seen Flunder Reese in so long because I'm always in gold. And Flunder Reese is no longer in gold. Do, 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 do. <gasps> it's Ryza! <gasps> He's targeting my field spell. And a card in my graveyard. And that one. I can just use this card to negate your effect. <laughs> and destroy the card. Look at that hand advantage. Psh, my deck also has great hand advantage. I just didn't draw into any runic cards. Wow, I can't believe they went into Ryza like that. Flew Wonderies. Wait, does this give him an extra normal summon? During your main phase, you can reveal up to two Winged Beast monsters in your hand, place them on the bottom of your deck in order, then draw a single number of cards, only expect once per turn. No, it doesn't. Oh, thank God. Because my Runic Fountain is in danger. I need to destroy that card. Doesn't give an extra normal summon? Good. Excellent. Yay, a runic card! I needed this. Okay, first we'll activate runic allure. Okay. Then we'll activate Kaiser Coliseum. Okay. Flew under ease. Uh huh. All right. Dreaming town. Then we'll activate runic tip. And a runic card from my deck to the hand. Ash blossom. Another one. Or was it the last guy I was going against had ash blossom? No. He was the last guy, I'm pretty sure. Also, how is he using Ash Blossom if he has Dimensional Fissure out on the field? Return this card to the deck. Flew under Reason, Robinia. 
Is Ash Blossom a discard or is it sent to the graveyard? It has to be a discard. You can discard this card. Okay. Ash doesn't specify graveyard. Maxi does. Oh no, all of these tribute summons. Give me another card. Oh, he let me keep Kaiser Coliseum? That means if I normal summon Maxi, he can't do anything. Dried winds. A flu cards even do. There's too much text. They they try their best. He's gonna summon a Ryza during my turn and spin all my cards. Unless I can normal summon my Maxi. Although he's just gonna keep going on my turn until I can uh, get my Maxi out. Which isn't gonna happen because he's just gonna keep activating his cards one after another. They summon a whole bunch and I surrender because ZZZ. I could have played this better. I wasn't completely ham bummed. Wait, he hadn't even used the effect of this card yet? Cauldron, yes, sir. Skill Drain or Summon Limit is probably better than Kaiser. Skill Drain or Summon Limit? Uh, I don't know. Like, Kaiser's pretty good. I only go into like one card. Wait, did he use that again? I just assumed this was a once per turn. I didn't think he'd be able to use it twice. Mr. Logs, why is earlier stream VOD mic sound weird? I don't know. It shouldn't. Your turn? No, our turn. <sighs> what I hate is my hand traps don't work against him. But his work against me. Messenger of Peace? Messenger of Peace might actually work, which is hilarious. Wait, they let me go first? Whoa, you have got to be kidding me right meow. Uh, special summon one runic monster from your deck. Well, I just realized I have no other runic monsters in my hand. Oh, come on. What deck were you playing? You don't even know what deck I'm playing. Oh, I can't check? It won't let me look at his deck. This deck is easy to beat. Why did he quit? I don't know. Maybe he just didn't want to deal with it. You can't see decks in Duelist Cup, but I want to see what his deck is. Your opponent choosing to go first or second? I can go first or second with this deck. It doesn't matter. You are going second? Good. I wanted to go second. They had enough of Runix. Technically, I built this deck to go second, but it can also go first. <gasps> Just as long as they're not playing Flu Underies. Oh no, this looks like Flu Underies. Or Labyrinth. Maybe I should just side out Maxi because it's not working against anything. <gasps> Ooh, it's Labyrinth. I love Labyrinth. To try Runic Exodia? No, I'm playing Runic Life Point Gain Mill. Labyrinth Stovey Torby. Quick effects, send this card to the graveyard, blah blah blah. Set welcome Labyrinth from the deck. Wait, did they actually use Ariana to search out Stovey? Labyrinth so fun. I love Labyrinth. What's the best form of destroying their field without Lightning Storm? Heavy Storm Duster. 
Whoa, what? <laughs> Perform repel high dive? All monsters they control can attack or activate their effects. Uh, each player applies one of these effects based on the number of set cards in their spell and trap card zones. All monsters they control cannot attack or activate their effects. Ooh, the attack of all monsters they control become double. Ooh, it's a standby phase. Activate the effect of a card. Okay, I need to set at least one card. Um, blah, blah, blah. Let's activate this so I can get my dude on the field. I need a special summon a runic monster. Welcome, Labyrinth. I think they're grieving themselves with the card. I love this card. It's hilarious. I try to make this work in Eldritch Poggers. <laughs> All I had to do was just set one card and I turned it off. I mean, that's one card I can't use this turn, but still. <gasps> oh, I keep forgetting to add Zark to this deck. Someone remind me to add Zark. Ooh, lovely lady of the labyrinth. Runic dispelling. I need the field spell, so this girl. Your mic is cracking the bot earlier today in so long. You showed your labyrinth deck list. Is it cracking now? Uh, target a one effect monster, banish cards. I think I just used Bite and Storm, right? No, I didn't. <laughs> Send this one to the grave. Search out the field spell. Absolute King Blackjack. Okay, whatever. Do, 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 do. Uh, Runic Fountain. Wait, what? <laughs> they whiffed? Oh, they whiffed because they used Welcome Labyrinth. <laughs> oh my god, that's funny. <laughs> they reset the top of their deck so they didn't have a guaranteed normal trap anymore. How's Labyrinth been doing? Really good. Labyrinth is amazing. I want to play Labyrinth in MD because I like trap based control strategies, but I don't know what exactly the goal is. The goal? Um, they are a control deck that has a ridiculous advantage, like, engine. They go plus like crazy. Alright, let's destroy that back row card. Target one card in your opponent's back row and pop it. Trap trick. <gasps> Uh-oh. Let's see, your opponent cannot activate monster effects in response to your normal trap card. Blah, blah, blah. You can target one normal trap card in a graveyard, set it to your field, you can activate this turn. If a fiend monster. Oh, this one doesn't protect your back row? It's the other one that does. I don't think the other one does either. It just protects itself. All right, activate Runic Fountain to draw three cards. One, two, three. Wait, what card did they set? I wasn't paying attention. Ghastly Fiend. Target one card in the field, destroy it, then send one Fiend monster from your deck to the graveyard. Oh, they're trying to proc their, their cards. Wait, does this one do anything when a, a trap card's activated? Destroy one card in your opponent's hand at random or on the field. Ooh, I don't want that to resolve. I have Glitch and Royal. Uh oh, I didn't mean to do that. That was a mistake. <gasps> okay, and then draw three. Oh, look at all those cards I drew. Another one that I can't, oh, I can use it. Absolute King Backjack. Stovey is also activating Stovey special summons itself, right? I think it does. He doesn't have any attack points, though. Allure. Oh, he has no he has no face down cards, so he can't activate effects. <laughs> That's hilarious. Uh, 
Uh, special summon a runic monster. We'll get the life point gain one. And then banish the top card of my opponent's deck. Ooh, it was a welcome labyrinth. Wait, why'd they quit? They weren't even in a losing position. They couldn't use their effects. All they did was just set a card. Add the arc. I will add the arc. The arc. One, two, one, two, three. Related cards. All right. Um, one, two, three. Let's see, I don't need this, or this, or this. This should be enough. Two, three... Can I go into this one? Starving Fusion Dragon. Uh, oh, I can go into it. Cool. And this one just for some insurance. Okay, all right, um, I'm going against a lot of Labyrinth, so these are super useful. Okay, I don't know if Dimension Shifter is super useful either. Hello, very cute person, who's that? Cut one Dried Winds, maybe? I need my Dried Winds, it's the only way I can deal damage to my opponent. Aren't you missing a pendulum one? No. I don't think so. We have Starving Venom. We have the Pendulum Dragon. We have the Synchro Dragon. And we have the XYZ Dragon. We're good to go. Souls of Brim King can banish from Graveyard if you're under Shifter. Can't banish from the Graveyard. That's true. However, the purpose of Shifter is to allow myself to go um, first, going second. However, it's not really affecting a lot of the cards I'm playing against. I think I'm better off if I just play a going second card. Like, evenly matched. To just completely ham bone my opponent, you know? Okay, let's see how this works. Droplet seems good? Uh, I don't really think so. Considering you draw lots of cards off a of fountain. But like I don't have any reason, like, I don't really have any removal. I have like one removal per turn. Super poly is great for starving venom. Oh yeah, super poly is a good idea. I forgot super poly exists. Where's Labyrinth? In your butt. <gasps> Ooh, am I going first? Ooh, I love going first. Runic Fountain, Kaiser Coliseum, Cauldron of the Old Man, activate the effect to gain some life points, oh no the Kaiser, target one effect monster, banish cards, top of your deck, equal to the number of the cards they control, bonk, special summon a runic card, Target one effect monster. Uh, the life point gain card. Okay, we'll use Runic Fountain. Oh, I chained this wrong again. <laughs> I keep doing this shit. <laughs> one of these days I'll get it correct. Draw one into my evenly matched. Okay, that's useless. All right, hopefully they don't have any like board breakers because I'm super vulnerable to a, a lightning storm and or a harpy's feather duster right now. Oh, <gasps> nothing. Yay, more life points. Cursing logs. I've never cursed before a day in my life. Okay, activate Cauldron of the Old Man. 
Gain another life point. Activate the effect of cauldron. Gain more life points. Okay, what does this one do? Your opponent draws one card. Okay, we'll do this. Your opponent draws one card. And then they banish a whole bunch of cards. Runic Allure banishes another one. Fountain gives me all my advantage back. You can play Foolish Bear Goods to dump Runic spells for more draws. Uh, I don't really... I require the field spell for that, though. Oh my god, they're playing a big deck. At least I'll never deck out since the Runic cards reset themselves. Battle phase. Oh my god, I'm gaining so many life points right now. With Soul Absorption being a good this deck, Runic cards banish a lot of cards, which just stacks up quickly. Oh! <gasps> I didn't even think of that. That's a good idea. That's genius. I think that's better than Cauldron of the Old Man. Runic has no trouble getting their field spell. Nice evenly. Thank you. <laughs> Utopia? I mean, let's say there's a way to get rid of Kaiser Coliseum. He's not going into anything. What are you doing, my dude, Astraltopia? Are you going to try to shenane me? Am I getting shenane over here? I don't think I'm getting shenane Yeah, give me some more life points. How is evenly matching Runic? I'm trying... Uh, match with Musketeer's version, but I'm worried about the battle phase restriction not working. Hmm, what do you mean? Activate this one. I just have it for going second. <laughs> Time to gain more life points. I could just start using them to burn instead and just win that way. Because they seem to have a lot of cards in their deck. <laughs> Target one effect monster on the field, negate its effects until the end of the turn. And then one more card, and then activate Runic Fountain to draw some cards. A card, I guess, because I don't have any other cards in the graveyard. Ooh, a Runic Destruction. Destroy one spell trap on the field. I should wait until my opponent's turn to do that. Battle phase skipped due to the effect. Activate this card, gain a thousand life points. Aren't there some cards you can make use of when you have so many life points? Yeah, there are. I should probably play them. Morning dual logs. Hello there, frozen soul. Are you doing a uh, start to burning? I could burn. <laughs> I think they want to lose. <laughs> Main phase two, end phase. Here, we'll use this to pop one of their back row cards and then banish the top four cards of their deck. And a lure to banish one more and then runic fountain to get some more cards. You can only control one runic allure. <gasps> Ooh, Soul of the Supreme King. I forgot I had that card. Runic Aromages. Ooh, Runic Dispel. Activate Cauldron of the Old Man. Activate Cauldron of the Old Man. Okay, activate Cauldron of the Old Man. Here, we'll just start burning. I think he wants to lose. Start burning. Okay. Oh, I forgot to go to the battle phase. <gasps> Oops. Oopsie poopsies. Runic jar would be fun. Mm hmm. Oh my god, I just lost so many of my life points. Did you forget to activate Cauldron? No, I used it.
I paid half my life points. I lost like 9,000 life points right there. A royal rare? Yeah, royal rare Supreme King Zark. The aforementioned Ancient Leaf. You think I should play Ancient Leaf? My man wants his gems for this torture. He can get his gems. Just attack into Supreme King Zark. Look, he can now actually go into stuff because of Kaiser Coliseum. Disgusting. I like it. I know. Me too. I love this deck. I wish I had royals. Me too. I wish I had royal lovely lady of the Silver Castle. Your opponent has added a card from their deck to their hand. Yes, I want to use my runic card. Now they have to discard something. Activate runic fountain to draw one card. The submissive breedable lady? What? Another Kaiser Coliseum. I've banished 17 cards from his deck so far. I'm just playing a pretty big deck. So he still has a lot of cards left. Utopia double? Ooh. Change tactics to draw a card. Zexel field. Oh no, are they going to try to go for like a Rongo Bongo type thing? Are you hand-boned? I don't think so. Utopia double. If they activate a spell card, I can just use Soul of the Supreme King. Can't you use Zark in response? Zark's effect is negated. He can't do anything. DZW Chimera Cloud. What the hell does this do? It's normal rarity, so it's probably not that good. What did he attach to himself? A Utopia? Do they play another Utopia double in their deck? They play two double or nothings! Whoa! I mean, I have a lot of life points. I can survive a 10,000 attack. Utopia Dragon Roar? Uh-oh, okay, that's a little bit different. Wait, now I can use this? Select one card to banish. Not target. Supreme King, select a card to summon this one. Select a card to summon the XYZ Dragon. Select a card to summon... Uh, attribute one monster, predator, negate if this fusion summon card, control sent to the graveyard. I think this one's probably better, because it destroys all my opponent's cards if it's destroyed. And then this card. There, now his whole field is unlocked. Kaiser Coliseum is no longer disabling him. When he used change tactics? I don't know what allowed me to use it, to be honest. Um, blah, blah, blah. Turn to extra deck. When your opponent activates a spell card or effect. Oh, okay. It's win effect. Last time I just missed the timing. That's why I couldn't do it. Because they like chained on themselves. <gasps> oh no. This monster can attack all monsters your opponent controls once each. <laughs> Rip. How, how did he gain so much attack points? Why does he have so many attack points? What happened here? Was it Utopia Double? They're getting pillowed? The thing is, if he attacks a uh, Starving Venom or Crystal Wing, I can stop it. He can't kill me this turn. I have too many life points. No, actually, all I have to do is attack into Pendulum and then Starving Venom and he wins. That's the order. It's genuinely over. I was not expecting this. 
Maybe he can't read? Now he figured it out. Then he just has to attack into Starving Venom and he wins. Was the Zark necessary? It was necessary because it's hilarious. Could you not summon a defense position? I could. I didn't think he would bring out a card that lets him attack all my monsters. That's not usually something that happens. And I don't exactly go against Utopia decks very often. Okay, so... I was going to replace Cold Old Man with, um... Soul... Soul something? What's it called? What's the one where you gain a bunch of life points? Soul... Uh, soul absorption. Soul ab. There it is. Soul absorb. Why is it an SR? Oh, why so many traps in a runic deck? Because. Hmm. Is this the unfunny jokes channel? Yes. I should also play um, that one card. Can we take out the evenly matches? No. Why would I do that? Add Ancient Leaf? Yeah. Ancient Leaf. Yo, Logs. I could play Ultimate Slayer. As a, a secondary going second card. Ooh, super polymerization. Also, you don't need metaverse. You're always getting the fountain off. Here, I'll remove these cards. I'll play super poly. I'll just add in a um, mud dragon. Mud dragon of the swamp. Okay, and one Pendulum Dragon monster, plus one Warrior type monster, two Dark Monsters of the Field, one Dark Fusion monster, plus one Fusion monster. Ooh, that's good against Despia. Two Runic monsters, two Runic monsters, four Dragon monsters. Okay. Wait, actually, the Predator Pokemon might work versus Branded? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I was like, ooh, this works versus Branded. Okay. Um, this should be good. Okay. Runic Spellbook is gnarly, too. Oh, my God. I didn't even think about Runic Spellbook. That's such a good idea. What's the meme for this deck? Uh, I gain life points and mill my opponent. Ash the Branded Fusion? No. Okay, so, all right. Uh-huh. Ten Ye Spirit Veshuda. Oh, no. Target one effect monster, negate its effects until the end of this turn. Banish the top three cards of your deck. Uh, oh, they have a Barone. We're hand-boned? Not necessarily. We should be fine. Maxi would have been nice. Psh, I had to remove it. We kept going against Labyrinth, and uh, I went up against a Flu Under Rees. And it's like, if it's going to be all Labyrinth and Flu Under Rees, this is going to be useless. They should make Branded Fusion a spell speed for quick play. I know, right? That's what I was saying. Every time I saw Branded Fusion, I was like, why is this not spell speed for? Well, I mean, actually, every time I see um, Albaz, I'm like, why is this not spell speed for? How could you make a Super Poly on legs and not make it spell speed for? Like, that's the best part of Super Poly. Do, 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 do. What are you thinking about so hard? Just add Long Yong to your hand. <laughs> what?
Uh, what are the variants of your drinks? Have you tried? I haven't tried anything else yet. This is the first one I had the idea for. That's it? Did they just said Grand Soul and Pass? What the f What the freaking frick? Are you freaking kidding me? You have got to be freaking kidding me right meow. I know he has blackout, but there's nothing I can really do about that. Spell speed 4 isn't real. Activate freezing curse. Uh, special summon a runic monster from your deck. From your extra deck. Okay. I showed you my card. Response. Max C. I showed you my card. Response. Okay. Runic Wings. They fear the logs. They do. Fish fear me. Women want me. Hopefully they don't have a negate for this. Oh, that's a, a reference to a shirt. If case anybody was trying to understand why I said that. Hello, Mr. Streamer. Hello there. Supposed before isn't real. It can't hurt you. Damn it, don't negate my cards, you piece of shit. I hate you. Soul Absorption. Okay. Dried Winds. Soul... Okay, my opponent's turn. All right, during their turn, I'm gonna shotgun Soul of the Supreme King. Do women want you? No. No, of course not. I've never once met one. Now we need to negate so they can negate the negate and negate the negate. Mr. Streamer said a bad word. I didn't say a bad word. Yes, pop off king. Ooh, Zark. Now they can get two cards on the field. You absolute buffoon, you incorrigible moron. Infinite impermanence. <laughs> I mean, I guess it will turn off. Oh, okay, just on this guy. It will stop the protection for blackout and also turn off my floodgate. Excellent. So they can just pop my whole field now if they want. Okay. He has two big rods. What? Standard. Place order. Long Guang? Wait, he's gonna do. Oh, he turned off my floodgate, so he can do that. He will summon the token, no problem. Why read that one out loud? Wait, what? What happened? Are you guys making fun of me for not reading your chat? Women fear me, fish fear me, men turn their eyes away from me as I walk. No one dares in my presence. I'm alone on this barren earth. <gasps> Same for real for reals. Ooh, they actually went into that card. Supreme Sword Soul. Ooh, and then I'm going to take a little bit of life point damage. Hello, Mr. Logs. I'm new here. Shut up. New here. Bullshit. 
You're a seventh month subscriber. No Baron, Rip Bozo. I know, right? I can't believe you didn't go into Baron de Fleur. Rip Bozo. Oh, did he just banish a card from the graveyard? Oh, he banished a couple of cards. Now I'm going to gain life points with soul absorption. And then I'll be able to destroy something. Although it looks like he procs first. There's a little bit of a delay before my stuff procs. Blackout the Chingying? I know he has Blackout. He can't just completely ham bone my field. Oh. Activate Dried Winds. Activate Soul Absorption to gain some more life points. High logs, I'm also new here. No, you're not. Blackout to destroy all my cards. So much for all my life points. I do like soul absorption. I think that was a good idea. There's a way to search out dried winds, right? I believe there's a way to search out dried winds. As much as I hate deck out strats as well, runics give you a choice of normal summon. I know, that's what I'm trying to think of right now. I think the arc probably doesn't work here because it makes me pay half my life points and I kind of need my life points. So I'm going to get rid of the Zark engine. And I think I want to go with um, the Assault Mode engine so I can go, so I can search out Dried Winds. This one does it, right? Uh, when your life points are higher than your opponent's, your opponent cannot target plant monsters you control with card effects, blah blah blah. If this card is Synchro Summoned, add one Humid Winds, Dried Winds, or Blessed Winds from your deck to your hand. If you gain life points, target one card your opponent controls and destroy it. Yeah, these ones, because I can actually go into this one with a... Uh, oh, the card I was playing. That I'm not playing anymore. <sighs> uh, if you normal or special summon a Roma monster, you gain a thousand life points. When an opponent's monster declares a direct attack, where life points are lower than your opponent's. This one can search out dried winds. Added a Roma monster from your deck to your hand. I don't do that. Blessed Winds. Does this have Blessed Winds too? What does Blessed Winds do? Send a plant monster from your hand or face it filled to the graveyard. Gain 500 life points. Um, Pay 1,000 life points. Spell summon one Aroma monster from your graveyard. Ooh. Target plant monster in your graveyard. Shelve your deck and gain 500 life points. Ooh. Emanu Iwato is also great. <laughs> Assault mode. I can't use Emanu Iwato though. What are you guys talking about? That would be too convenient. Oh, what if I played that one, that one card that the one Labyrinth player was playing against me? To turn off all effects. As an alternative, Emanu Iwato... Doesn't like the only way to turn off his effects with like Dispel. No, not Dispel. There's one of them that like negates a monster effect. With Freezing Curse isn't the only way to turn off his effect. Run a Shino Baroness engine for Mommy Wanto Turbo. <laughs> a Shino Baroness engine? Um, are you crazy? This card, three of those, and one of these. Emergency teleport. Okay, two emergency teleports. Just the adventure engine. I could run the adventure engine as well. E para. E. E paria. Let me also run Ash Blossom. Just so I can ham bone my opponent. Okay, so I have a way to search out dried winds now. Um, Kaiser Coliseum hasn't been performing well, so I'm gonna remove it. And I'm not gonna replace it with anything. Dried winds, ancient leaf. 
Let's remove that. I don't need it. I don't need any golden ladybug. Okay. Hmm. Plus three. Do I have any level six synchro monsters? Oh, I do. Aroma. <gasps> All my aroma cards. Oh my god. Their levels are perfect. I'm also just going to add in Shen Shen. Because it's pretty good. Even if it does screw over my own stratagems. Runic Aromage? No, this is Life Point Gain Mill. A Legal Knight, I think? What about a Legal Knight? Adding Shen Shen because it's your BFE? I'm thinking maybe Shen Shen probably not a good idea because I need my Runic cards to go to the graveyard. I'll, I'll have to remove it. I'm just adding it because it's also really good against my opponent. Mechlord life point gain turbo win. Oh, I guess I could add that card to this deck too. I am gaining a lot of life points in this deck. <gasps> Nibiru! That's what I should add to this deck. Ooh. Runic Allure. Okay. Activate Runic Destruction. Special summon a card. We'll go into this one so I can get my field spell. Okay, Runic Allure. Activate this card's effect. Select a card to discard. <gasps> Ooh, is there a way to like stop Ash Blossom? I don't think there is. I think if my opponent has Ash Blossom, I'm kind of just ham boned. Okay, activate this one. Your opponent draws one card. Cross out. Yeah, I'd have to play like cross out or something. I was thinking like, is there a hand trap I could play that could stop Ash Blossom? And the answer is not really. What are they playing? Weather Painters? Oh, they're about to get Shenanade. Draw three cards. Ooh. Soul Absorption, excellent. Psy Frame, activate its effect. Uh, assault the Beast, activate Assault Beast. Oops. Assault Mode, activate, activate this card, reveal Assault Mode. Special summon this card, increases level by one, so it goes with a five, so you can go into a level six synchro monster. Ask yourself, I'm not Miwa. Okay, then we get these two cards out. How's it going? It's going all right. Activate Sweet Jasmine, search out Dried Winds. Okay, and pass. Whoa, shots have been fired. Okay. Oh, now I want to play this deck. This deck is so good. It's literally the best deck I've ever made in my life. Oh, I probably should have activated Dried Winds already. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh. This one lets me destroy any card, right? Target one card opponent control. It does let me destroy any card. Excellent. Dimensional Fissure does not hand bone me either. Oh. Oh. I can't believe they've done this. Wait, why did the effect activate? There's nothing to destroy. <laughs> what? Let me mill you! None of these assholes let me mill them. Oh my god, they scooped. Is there a hand trap I can play that stops Ash Blossom? I need specifically a hand trap. That activates while I have a card on the field. 
No, I don't think there is. Other than called by. Skullmeister? No, I don't think so. Play Nibiru? Yeah, Nibiru is a good idea. I should play Nibiru instead of Ash Blossom. Triple Nibiru. Okay. Hello, Mr. Dulox. Can I have the list for the Cactus Fighter Loop? I don't have it anymore. It was really bad. You don't want it. You should be able to just watch the video and get a deck list from it, right? Okay. Let's do one more. This is a short stream and I mean it. I have a question. Do? What is your question? Take out Shen Shen? Fuck, I forgot to take out Shen Shen. You're right. Do 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 oh Grandlord Turbo Life Game. All right. I can add that card to this deck too. Add Samurai Destroyer. Oh, that's not a bad idea. A combo deck? I'll be right back while they combo off. Oh, I'm still in ghost mode? I actually came back a little bit earlier, but I saw that he was still comboing off, so I'm going to use the restroom too. I think I'm ham boned. Add time? Here you go. Does Runic go well with Musketeers? Runic is an engine. You can play with a lot of things. Is he done comboing off yet? Is it penned FTK? Hmm. That's enough for the FTK. No, actually, I think he needs one more card. That's the FTK right there. What was your record for the fastest restroom break? I don't know. I'll do one more after this. Just because this one is... He's not going for the FTK? You have the FTK. What are you doing, my dude? He can still do it? No, he can't. Is your brain on FTK mode? He has the FTK on field. I don't know why he just wouldn't go for the FTK. 
Have you tried the card of demise of Runic? It's cracked? No. That's a good idea. <gasps> Another Astrograph Sorcerer. No, I guess he could still go into the FTK. He has it right now. Although, I don't think he's going to do it because he also already had it earlier. No, wait, he doesn't have the FTK because he already used the effect. Oh my god, what the fuck is he doing? Why go through all this effort and not just play the FTK? He's just taking longer to do his turn when he could have won already. We need a shorter timer. I know, right? I think he doesn't know what he's doing. He's going for some kind of combo here. Man, this hand sucks. <clears throat> Speed running the FTK? No, he can't do it anymore. He's hand boned his FTK. He's just gonna go for like negates or something. Five hours later. <laughs> damn it, why did I have to go against a goddamn pendulum deck on my last duel? I wanted a fast duel. Can we have a clicking buttons emote? No, I don't have any more emote slots. I would need more subs. I'm at, uh, only... I'm at a very low amount of subs. Oh my god, a third Dragon Supreme King Starving Venom. Ooh. Ooh, Titanic Galaxy. You heard him, we need more subs, boys. Psh. I don't even know how many I need. I need like a whole bunch. I don't know what you're talking about, Noxus. The buttons of negates. I've never seen Titanic Galaxy summoned. Yeah, I've never seen this combo before. It seems bad compared to what you can do with this. Pendulums are so bad at MD, my god, some dumb dumb on Twitter. I mean, if I had any hand trap, I could have stopped this. I just didn't draw into any of them. Please time out. The timer is not that long. He has to be like hurting on time right now. I wish I could see my opponent's timer, though. Thanks for the sub, Fafnir. Man, he's just still going. Why? What is his end goal here? He has one spell negate. That's it. Appalooza. Oh, he has two monster negates now. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, and a Borlode Savage Dragon. Okay, that's much better. Because this card also has a taunt ability on it. Should be like. End goal is to make us suffer. What does that card do? Searches during the end phase. Oh look, a pen deck with pen cards on the end board. What cards? Okay, one Omni, one Spell Negate. Ooh, Runic Fountain. Okay, let's activate Runic Fountain to force out one of those negates. Cross out can negate Ash. There's negate number one. It took him long enough. 
<gasps> My runic fountain. Oh no. All right, my turn. He has a hand trap. Oh yeah, he could also have hand traps too. I didn't even think about that. Uh, what is he doing? Is he disconnecting? That'd be hilarious if he disconnected. He might DC. Good. Ash incoming. Runic fountain number two. You think he has something for Runic Fountain? <gasps> He's gonna pop it with Time Pendulum Graph. Use the effect was selected. Okay. Runic Disruption. Let's Runic Disruption this and then get negated by Borolode Savage Dragon. We might run out of time if he has too many interactions. He's not going to do it? Ooh. Ooh, okay. Astrograph Sorcerer. Wait, how come I can't use this? Wait, how come I can't use Runic Fountain? Oh, it's because I activated on the activation. It wasn't on the field yet. Okay, he still has his um he still has his Omni to get, he just didn't use it. Oh my god, Maxi. YouTube guy, I like your content. Why thank you. Special summon this dude right here. Activate the effect, yes. Appalooza. Effect number one. We'll use another emergency teleport. Not sure if you want to maxi against Runic. Oh wow, his deck is really low on cards. Another one. Oh no, all my cards. Unfortunately, the card effect is a hard once per turn. Oh, I'm one card away from being able to use it. I thought I had the BLS in my deck. I usually run that card. Battle phase. Uh oh. Yep, I didn't draw into any of my going second cards. Going second. Looks like the negates one against Mill. Rip Bozo. Add Grenell. When a face up monster controls shoulders by card effect and sent to the graveyard, spoil some of this card from your hand. Once per turn, target one synchro monster your opponent controls. Equip that card to this card. This card gains attack and defense equal to half of your life points and attack equal to the combined attack of all monsters equipped to it. Okay. That sounds funny. We'll play this. I'll go down to one dried wind because I can search the card. And um um and um we'll get rid of one of these. And what is a good synchro monster that I can go into besides Shenshin? Remove Shenshin. I know. Samurai Destroyer? No! <gasps> what about this one? Gain Swing Attack for each monster effect is activated. It has 4,000 attack quick effect. Shuffle this card and all monsters into the deck. Hmm. Do any of these gain me life points? Ooh, what about Chaos Ruler? Ooh, what about Draco Berserker? He teleports. TG Librarian? No, I don't special summon enough for TG Librarian to matter. <gasps> the new zombie cards! Oh no, I can't do that. Hmm, Sardis Dragon, which just remind you before you blame the chat. Draco Berserker is my second choice. Draco Berserker is pretty good. When your opponent activates a monster effect, quick effect, you can banish it. If this attacking card destroys effects on my battles, into the graveyard, attack again. Second attack. Psychic Life Translator. 
Uh, is that the one I'm thinking of? Yeah, the, no, this card sucks. Beals? I can't go into Beals. It requires a dark monster. I think. Let me double check. Beals. One dark tuner plus one non tuner. Oh, I can go into Beals. Cupid pitch. I didn't know this was that engine could go into Beals. I need to make a video. Top 10 synchro monsters for this engine. This is just like an alternative. Ideally, I'm only going into like my aroma cards. Oh, this one's good too. Is Beals a legacy card? Master pack. You need to Mechlord Assembly Turbo Out Grendel. Mechlord Assembly? What? Mechlord Assemble. Assembly. When this card's activated, add a Mech Lord card from your deck to your hand. You can activate one of these effects per turn. You can only use one of these following effects per turn. Discard one card, target one monster you control, destroy it. If a phase of Mech Lord monster you control is by battle or card effect, you can target one card in the field. Other and destroy it. If a face up Mech Lord monster you control is by battle or card effect, target one other face up spell trap in the field and destroy it. Target you monster you control and destroy it. <laughs> to search out Granal. Hmm, sure, why not? I don't really have room for it, but I'll do it anyway. Uh, I could reduce some of my runics, but I'd rather not. We'll get rid of Terraform. And... Uh... These two cards. I got rid of so, so many of my runics. Not top 10 dark tuners? No. Oh, someone redeemed ad time? Why do you guys keep redeeming ad time? One of these days, I will mill. And you guys will be all like, wow, I can't believe you milled. That was as, as insane. That was amazing. How crack is new zombie structure deck? It's pretty good. It's the draw phase. Would you like to activate the effect of a card? Yes, I'll use Runic Tip. Add a Runic card from your deck to the hand. Oh, I can add this card. I'm just gonna add one of the random ones. Why is Horses Redeem so expensive now? Because I don't want you guys to use it. Uh, special Summon a Runic Monster from the deck. Wait, what card did I banish? Maxi? I have no idea what deck they're playing. Infinite Impermanence? Oh no. Oh no. Wait, do I have an option to run less ads than that? Not really. Okay, Psy Reflector, activate Psy Reflector's ability, search out Assault Beast, then we'll do the engine. Uh, activate Psy Reflector, Assault Mode, activate. Uh, oh, I just realized something, I can totally go into Barone. I just bring them out and I have them at the correct level. <laughs> Let's see, this is level 9 and this is level 8. I can use my card to go into Baron. Cat. Okay. Remind that Rainbow Life combos really well, the Yang Zing Unleash. I wouldn't say they combo. 
Wait, no, I think that's exactly what it is. The, the thing I'd argue is, well, that's not a good combo. That's a, a combo you have to build your deck around trying to get it to work. Uh-oh, are they going to go into Zodiac? Broad Bowl? Wait, I can go into Zodiacs too. I can just play Zodiacs in this deck. Borbo. The poo -diac. <laughs> Exactly. The poo -diac. Need more life point cards. Wait, they're going into Zeus immediately? Just a two material Zeus? Weird Zeus turbo? Yeah. That was odd. Okay. I got nothing. Hi. Oh. <gasps> Guys, be cool. It's Aku Miaoi. Probably scared of Nibiru? Uh-huh. Probably. Zodiac Ram Ram? Oh no! You mean Aqua Miaoi? No, that's not her name. Aqua here. Hello there. What are you even saying? I need to change this deck a little bit. I was like, wait, didn't you stream already? I did! The new pack came out and it's full of a lot of cards I've been waiting for for a very long time. Okay, so. Here's the deal. I need more runic cards. I have too many non-runic cards in this deck. I need to remove some of these cards to play more runic cards. However, I can also play Barone. Barone. Baron. I only have one Barone. Runic is so expensive. Shen, Shen. Here, I gotta... I have to remove these. I need more runic cards. Target one of your opponent's special summoned cards. Uh, adds cards to their hand. Here we go. More than 16 cards in the extra deck? Do I have more than 16 cards in my extra deck? Gains once per turn. I have my super poly options. Ghosty? Ghost mode? Here we go. Look, it's ghost mode. Wait, why is it always like to the side? There. You teach Aqua how to play Runic. <laughs> you guys have to stop calling her Aqua. I'm not trying to get her to hate me over here. To get a Royal Finish Runic card, thought so was nice. A Royal Finish Runic card. By the way, Grinnell is a brick if you can't find a way to destroy your own monsters by card effects. My opponent's going to destroy my cards by card effect. Don't worry. Just a liquid cat now? A liquid cat? What do you mean? Here, I'll play two assemblies and one Grinnell. How about that? Oh, fuck. I still need to remove a card. Oh, I'll just remove one wings. I never go into more. It recycles itself anyway. Moist Cat, the streamer, like Liquid Snake. She can always hate me. I'm good with it. What? What the fuck are you guys talking about? Grinnell, more like Garnet. Oh, fuck, I was only supposed to do one more stream that I was going to get off. <laughs> Let's play. You gain a ridiculous amount of life points for Grinnell. Moist Critical. Underworld Goddess. I got a raid from Moist Critical once. So you're a VTuber, right? No. I'm not a VTuber, I'm a flesh tuber. Despite the ghost thing, I swear. 
Wow, this is a hand, all right. <laughs> full of fucking bricks. Dusty old bones, full of green dust. Add a card from your deck to your hand. Still lying. What are you trying to say? Aku Miyawi, Yu-Gi-Oh streamer? Aku doesn't really play um, video games on her stream. Activate Runic Wings. Discard one card from the hand. Add Runic Fountain to my hand. I uh, don't have any more Runic cards to play, so I'm hand boned. How do you mean he's a spider VTuber? What? Akumiya, the VTuber? No, that was a that tweet was taken out of context. Okay, you guys just don't understand the economy. What does Akumiyawi do? Do you have a clip to demonstrate for us? I'm not gonna play the clip anymore. Does it banish itself for cost or does it go to the graveyard? Yeah, tributes and goes to the graveyard. Best way to get into Yu-Gi-Oh! Advice, please? I have no idea. You just kind of play the game, I guess? You you have to learn how every single card in the game works. And it takes lots and lots of just experience. Be friends with Logs and he'll teach you. <laughs> I mean, she wants me to teach me. I would totally teach her. All the advice is perfect. Oh no, my card went to the graveyard. Watch the anime. The anime sucks. Yeah, studying. Yeah, the game is very like... I don't know. I don't know how to teach this to a new person. You just like pick a deck and just like play it until you eventually learn all the rules. There's a lot of reading when it comes to learning all the new decks for the first time. Useless advice logs? Uh, I'm gonna look at my script. I have a script on this. I just never actually published it because I didn't think it was good advice. Ooh, a runic card! May I say get fucked? No. Let's see, Yu-Gi-Oh scripts, um, how to, how to, let's see, how to make titles for thumbnails, how to make titles for clip videos, uh, how to play Yu-Gi-Oh. Let me just type in how to, how to finish topics, how to, how to play Yu-Gi-Oh for new players. I do have a video on this. I just never made it. Okay. Okay. Good advice is playing Trap Tricks. Special summon a runic monster from your deck. Yes, I would love to special summon a runic monster from my deck. The lazy logs? Shut up. You're lazy. Okay. Runic. Fountain. No, no, no. We want to use this. No, no, no. We want to use this, this one first. to get two cards and we don't want to use this one at all get Akumiyawa to read the script for you what script oh for the new players oh excellent idea why didn't I think of that you're literally a genius no uh ooh, a dark fusion monster plus one dark monster LOL. Wait, what? I'm sure she has better things to do than read my scripts. You guys gotta know, like, reading scripts is hard. Like, it's it's work. It's not something you just, like, ask people to do. <laughs> you have to pay people for it. It's hard work. It's arduous. It takes forever. Like, it, it's a little bit more work than just, you know, like, the, the ads or, like, the script readings for fun. Okay, target one effect bonds you control. Ooh, I can special summon another card from the extra deck. Hmm, or I can just save this for my opponent's turn to negate stuff. 
Battle phase skipped. Oh yeah, right. Get skipped. The new prayer plant fusion sucks so bad. He's not as good as I thought he would be. That's for sure. I'd say build a decent deck, free to play with the initial gems, play a bunch to see the decks and how they play. Select a target. Oh, does he just come back? Ooh, he just comes back. When are we teaching Aqua Meowy how to play? Shut up. I gotta be playing single player mode, whatever, for this game helped me a lot. Oh yeah, I use single player mode in order to learn new decks too. That's a good idea. All right, how to play Yu-Gi-Oh for new players. Step number one, how to win the game. The objective of Yu-Gi-Oh, oh, this is like an actual step-by-step like, -step guide. I'm not reading this. Basically, the game is really complicated and not very new player friendly. <laughs> it requires a lot of reading. A real guide. Fallen of Al, why do they keep going into Fallen of Albaz? Like what the hell, man? Activate Runic Freezing Curse, target one effect monster your opponent controls. Also watching the anime kind of helps with learning about Yu-Gi-Oh! Does it really? But then like, that's like expensive and stuff. Wait, Forbidden Droplet. What are they doing? Fallen of Abbas has to use himself as a material so it won't work. Please make an audiobook on how to play this game, Mr. Logs. <gasps> an audio- wait, what the fuck are they doing? Forbidden Droplet doesn't do shit. You absolute buffoon, you moron. Imagine reading, right? <laughs> Aku Miyawi, when are you streaming next? When are you doing more readings? Audiobook reading. I remember my Patreon had a reward where like I would record stuff. I just forgot it existed. Ooh, I can activate another runic card. Uh, good question. <laughs> Play card, watch your opponent. Multi-summon, get traumatized. Wait, what are they doing? Attacking into my dude? Okay, whatever. Playing someone you really love, like Logs loves Meowie, would help me learn need more fun. Oh my god. You guys are ridiculous. This is why I hate all of you. Except I don't. I love you, chat. I, I was kidding. I didn't actually mean that. You can't read? I can read just fine. You can't read. I thought you were best friends. No, just colleagues. Special summon this thing. You don't like me on mail? <laughs> no, don't say that. How do I do this again? I discard first, then activate fountain. Return two cards to draw two more. Run runic to ruin Albaz game. Draw two cards. Don't say because of what? What? What are you guys talking about? Okay, and then pass. Prime. Prime subs are lovely. Oh yeah, what is the, the prime thing you say? I forgot. I'll have to send that collab. Uh, yeah, I guess it's technically a collab. I'll have to send that VOD to one of my editors. And I'll tell them, you see this VOD right here with Aku Miyawi? I need you to clip every, every little thing. It's the end of the turn. Runic Destruction, target one spell trap your opponent controls, destroy it, banish three cards. Activate Runic Allure. Hi Dulox, how are you today? Today has been a day, all right. Gosh, where do I even begin to complain about my day? So today I woke up and I was just like existing, you know? You know, already pretty bad. Oh, 
<gasps> Thank you for the prime sub. I'm so honored to receive one of your prime subs of the month. <laughs> I gotta write that down. <laughs> Let me see. From Akumiyawi. <gasps> Can I get a voice clip of you saying that? Do you have a voice clip? I think you said that in one of my streams. I'll have to look for it. First win of the stream? No, I've won a whole bunch. Thank you for your prime sub. I am so honored to receive your one and only prime sub of the month. Your one and one prime sub? Your one and only prime sub. That's probably better. For free? She's a... Uh... She's she's always on that hustle. I wish I could hustle as well as Akumiyawi. I do everything for free. Well, that's because that's because <laughs> I remember one time I mentioned how much I make in like Mari's chat and everybody got so mad at me. They're like, why are you flexing? I was like, what? You guys asked. I'm just going to say that. I was just going to explain why I don't. Um, I'm not as good of a hustler as, as Aku Miyawi. You should definitely ask her to record one for you. <gasps> that, I don't think that's a good idea. If I just start... If I just start sending messages to Aku Miyawi to have her record stuff for me for free that's just like I don't know it, seems, it just feels weird I don't think that's really something you can just ask someone you just met like a week ago obviously not for free but for money she doesn't do commission like voice lines though you can't just ask someone to just start doing commission voice lines. Like, that has to be something they already do. Dude, you're a spider just scaring just a mission? Shut up. At this point, just hire her. I mean, she has, like, her own job. Like, not everybody wants to work for someone else. It's You can be just, like, insulting to just offer someone a job. Or, you know, pay to work. Without actually knowing how they do things. The pay isn't good. She'll give in. I mean, if you say so. Um, anyways. Who should we raid? <gasps> Ooh, Asagi Ame is on. I think she had, like, some redeem to lick the mic. What was it? <gasps> it's just five subs? Oh my god, I'm gonna get Ame to lick her... I mean, it's a joke. It's all a joke, guys. It's not for reals. Caught red-handed. Asagi Ame? <laughs> Let's go to Asagi Ame. You guys know Asagi Ame. She's, she was on the, the game show. I'm open to commission ideas, by the way. <gasps> I'll have to hit you up. I'm open to commission ideas. I'll have to, I'll have to, um, spam your DMs. Oh, wait, before I go. <laughs> you guys want to see a, a funny clip from Leah? Oh, this is, uh, here, let me make it bigger. I have to show you a clip. Let's see here. If I go to this mode over here. Uh I can't figure this out. I'll just move it over here. I didn't think this would take so long to set up. I just wanted to show you guys real quick. 
it's not that big a deal. Okay. Oops, I clicked on the wrong thing. Look at this clip. Oh my god, this is what I sound like when, um, whenever Duologues DMs me. <laughs> I don't have any business with you. You're ready? Yeah, like, that was not worth all the buildup it took to set that up. <laughs> Let's go over to Ame. <laughs> it's because you muted her? I muted her because she she uh she 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 spread lies on the internet about me. Okay, that's all it was. All right, I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. <laughs>